Welcome back to the channel. I'm Rochelle and this is Brampton Gardener and today we are going to do a garden tower update. Okay, so here's the first one. So we planted this in May, I think it was middle of May, probably around there. So this is the smaller, oh, so this is the smaller one of the two. We have the purple petunias in here. The ginger is super slow, I don't know. Come on, ginger, let's go. Uh, my nasturtium's doing just fine and a little baby cilantro over there. Uh, this, I believe, is the kohlrabi. So I have a couple of the kohlrabi in here, or it could be broccoli, I can't remember, and I didn't label it. Uh, I got my tarragon and some of my lobelia is doing fine. This bean plant is doing really good. I don't know how well it would do and it keeps getting knocked over. Dexter's bumped into it a few times, but we're getting a handful of beans on there. So that's really nice. And then back here, um, I think this was the arugula. It's going to seed. So we're just going to save those seeds on that. So that one's doing fine. Nothing spectacular. This one, this one is doing amazing. It is full sun. This petunia, this is one petunia and it is just enormous. The, even the, the violas are still doing good, but this one is mainly uh, has a lot of the tomatoes. You know what, I'm gonna take it off the stand because it's getting a little awkward, hold on. This one is also Dexter's favorite planter. <laughs> and I'll show you why in just a minute. Look at all of these beautiful tomatoes in here. Oh my goodness, look at all of them. Look at all those. Can you see them? I know the sun's kind of bright, but oh my goodness. Beautiful, and who loves ripe cherry tomatoes? Gardener's dogs do. There you go, baby. Oh, who's gonna be a happy boy now? Take him 10 minutes to eat that thing. So yeah, so we've got four of the Tiny Tim. Excuse me, buddy. Why are these flies over here? God, annoying. Okay, so we have four Tiny Tims in here. So two over here on this side, and they are super, they're just producing. Every couple, every day we come out and we get a couple ripe tomatoes off of it. One for me, one for Dex. So he's loving it. So yeah, this is this is doing really, really well. Super happy in here. I gotta fertilize it again, but it's doing good. Um, this bean is doing pretty good. None of my red ones have any um, babies on it yet, but my green ones all do. This uh, cinnamon basil is going banana pants, as Nicole at Nicole Smith Gardening would say. And then I have some arugula coming out. It's very pretty didn't do so great. Um, this I can't believe really if it's spinach or not. I have some pepper back here. They've got some little pepper plants, little fruit on them. They're not getting a lot of sun. So I do try to kind of, um, every so often I rotate it, but uh, the backside is still not getting as much sun as the front, but it's, it's working really well. And I'm just really impressed with how many plants um, I can get in such a small area. So here, some of these are just not doing great. I can pot them up with something else. Maybe put some spinach in there or whatever, some lettuce but my stevia is doing really well. So yeah, that is the update on the tower gardens. And how are you doing next? Are you still eating that tomato? Yeah. So thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe and click that notification bell so you can get all of the updates and see how big this thing's gonna get at the end. I wonder if we're gonna get a kohlrabi off the other one. Who knows? Bye. And uh, now to play with it for the next Are you going to eat it or just look at it? 